Taxi drivers and advocates took over the steps of this New York State courthouse in Lower Manhattan, rallying ahead of a congestion pricing hearing. A mandatory state issue fee they nicknamed, quote, suicide surcharge. According to the New York Taxi Workers Alliance, eight cab drivers committed suicide just last year. We don't want to see any more suicides. We don't want any more bankruptcies. We need our governor and our state legislator to show us some mercy. Taxi and for hire drivers, along with their union representatives, walked away with a small victory today after a judge ruled in their favor to continue a temporary restraining order blocking congestion pricing fees, which is about $2.50 for yellow cabbies and $2.75 for Uber and Lyft per ride below 96th Street in Manhattan. The restraining order was issued back in December after a group of drivers filed a lawsuit against Governor Cuomo. The fee was initially scheduled to go into effect January 1st. Listening to all the arguments from the state, one thing that was really hard to stomach is an utter, like, utter, you know, disregard for the fact that people are really struggling. The governor says the fee will help the congestion problem and fund the MTA and its desperate need to repair their aging subway system. State attorneys argue the drivers and their unions knew about the legislation for eight months and don't understand why it's an issue now. While drivers say the MTA can't ride on their backs to rebuild the subways because it would only cause financial hardships to them and their families. What they want from me? They want my blood, they want my, uh, my organs, my kidney, my heart. What do you want from me? Very emotional day earlier today. Now both sides will be returning to court January 31st.